Hi, I'm Jeremy Feetz, managing partner of thelawfirm.com. This video is an introduction to some of the things you need to know if you or a loved one has suffered complications from hernia mesh. Patients across the United States have experienced complications following a hernia repair where the surgeon implanted Atrium C Cure Mesh or Johnson & Johnson Ethicon Physio Mesh. Both the Physio Mesh and the C Cure Mesh is made with a combination of polypropylene, which is essentially the same material as fishing line, woven together and then coated with various substances. We believe the design of these meshes make them prone to failure. In fact, we believe the design of these mesh products cause various injuries to a very high number of patients implanted with these devices. Physio Mesh was withdrawn from the market in May of 2016 amid growing evidence of the high failure rates. Both types of mesh were first introduced to the US market using the controversial 510K FDA approval process. Unfortunately, this FDA system allows medical device companies to introduce new medical devices into the market with relatively little scientific study and testing. We believe the manufacturers cared more about getting their products on the market than they did about the damage they would cause to everyday Americans. It might be different if these coated hernia mesh products were actually better at treating hernias, but we believe the evidence is clear that these products were in fact far worse and not better than the hernia mesh products that have been used for years. We believe that big pharma companies knew this or should have known this and put profits ahead of people. There's no question that it is devastating and frightening for a person to be told that the mesh that was supposed to solve a problem is actually causing problems inside their body. Even more devastating when a person has to go under the knife to have some or all of that defective mesh removed. Now it's not necessary to know the specific type of hernia mesh used during your surgery. We know that a lot of people don't know whether one of these meshes was used. This information is available to the attorneys at thelawfirm.com through your medical records, which we obtain on your behalf. The consultation and case evaluation are free and all cases are pursued under a contingency fee agreement, which means there's no fees or expenses unless we get a recovery or a settlement for you. Dozens of lawsuits have been filed in courts around the country. These are consolidated in a multi-district litigation called an MDL for short. And this is a system for managing the thousands of cases that are being brought together and a structure to help keep these cases moving forward. Our team monitors MDL orders daily to ensure that our clients stay compliant with the directions of the judge to keep defective medical device cases moving forward. We will be issuing regular updates to our clients about progress in the cases and any and all available settlement programs that arise in the future. I hope you found this video helpful. I hope you'll call us for a free consultation. And watch our hernia mesh FAQ video for more answers to the most common questions about making a hernia mesh claim.